we continue our back to school coverage in Depew with News Force Katie Alexander. Yeah, she's getting ready for a special welcome back tradition at the high school there. Katie, good morning to you. Good morning, Jordan and Mel. The high schoolers will be showing up about 7:15, 7:20 this morning. But they're really their first experience on this first day of school involves the school buses. This is Doug Baumgarten. He is the transportation supervisor, and you guys have a lot to celebrate as you start the school year. Yes, we do. We have uh, all our new buses with uh, Wi-Fi on them, and uh, <clears throat> the safest vehicle in the in the world to transport students to, to school. So you have three new buses this year and you were able to spec them out to get sp state aid for that, correct? Yes, we did. <laughs> we spec them out for state aid and uh, they're the newest vehicles in our fleet. So the big message, of course, is safety. safety. What's going on with this? <clears throat> safety is uh, very paramount with the kids. Um, <clears throat> just make sure that the public stops for our school buses. <clears throat> our school buses are only stopped for 10 seconds and just when the kids on the bus please <clears throat> they're the biggest vehicle out there you can't can't miss them. you got to be able to see them to and, stop. and i think i saw that you are still hiring school bus drivers correct yes we are we're always hiring school bus drivers uh, <clears throat> school bus drivers it's it's a great job uh, very rewarding job um, anybody who needs a wants a job please come in and we'll get train you and get you a driver's license for the big bus and it'll be very rewarding. And of course it takes a special person to uh, be the school bus driver because you're dealing with these students, their first face they see in the morning, the last face they see in the afternoon. What kind of person are you looking for? We're looking somebody with um, a great personality, um, somebody that life loves kids and is very patient. And who can take care of these awesome new buses. We have a lot more exciting uh, opportunities to talk about here throughout the rest of the morning here on Wake Up, so make sure you stick with us. For now, reporting live, Katie Alexander, News 4.